Hello, this is Christy. Camtasia 2021 introduced support for Lottie files. Lottie files are a kind of JSON files that are animated, so they're vector, they're scalable, and animated files. A little bit like SVG on steroids, because the instructions in the file actually display the objects that go in there, the colors, the shapes, and everything is vector, so it can be scaled at any size without loss in quality, and also it can be animated. And Lottie files, they've been created initially in Adobe After Effects, so you can go to Adobe After Effects and use a plugin to create these animations and export them to this JSON format called Lottie. This file format is now supported in Camtasia. So for a long time, users of Camtasia have requested more advanced animation functions and ability to animate maybe characters or other things in Camtasia. And Camtasia has always been a bit behind on terms of animation. All the animation you can do in, in Camtasia is pretty much linear. You can't really do very complex stuff. And this is a good and welcome new feature that was added in Camtasia 2021, the ability to import these Lottie files. So where can you get Lottie files? Well, you can go to websites such as LottieFiles.com and you can see here there's a lot of animations that you can download. There are free animations and also there is like a marketplace and some of them are paid. You can buy some of them and you can browse these. You can search and find something that maybe you can use in your project like a subscribe button or something like that or maybe a nice animation. It's a little bit like animated clip art if you want. There are also software that's open source and paid that you can use to create your own Lottie files. So let me demonstrate how these work now in Camtasia. I'm going to take this animation here with this uh, rocket and I'm going to download it. So you need a free account on Lottie files. For example, you need a free account and you can download these ones that say free here. I'm just going to download this one. Before you download, you can preview the animation and you can pause it and see how long it is and everything else. And and you can download it from this one or you can convert it to a, a GIF. I'm not going to do that, so I'm just going to download this JSON file. After you download this file, it's on your disk as a uh, JSON file and you can open it with Notepad and it looks like this. So it's all parameters and instructions and shapes, definitions and everything else like this. So let's see how this works in Camtasia. I'm going to drag this on top of Camtasia and import it. So I have Camtasia 2021 open here. I'm just going to drag this file into my media bin. And there you go. You can see already the animation that was included in the preview on the website. And now you can just add it to your project, to your canvas, just like any other video clip. On the timeline, if you look, the duration is about four or five seconds, I believe, depending on how long and how many things are being animated here, it's, it's the duration is changeable. So let's play this. So there you go, you can see the animation is playing just as the preview and this behaves just like any other clip. If you want, you can uh, group it, you can extend frames, you can cut it and make it shorter if you want, or you can apply visual effects to it. Let me just add a stupid uh, effect to it, like a colorize. There you go, it changes the color and you can play with it just like any other video clip in your timeline. And you can use this as a clip art, like an illustration. And because they are uh, vector files, they are scalable to any size. So if I zoom out here and just make this completely huge, you will notice if I get closer to the, to the file here, there is no loss in quality. Maybe Camtasia previews this a bit slowly, but actually this is a vector file. So there will be no loss in quality. And also it is transparent. So you can actually put it on top of other objects. So I'm just gonna play with this a little bit. I'm gonna import a photo here of the moon and scale this like that, place it on my canvas and this clip with the animation is going to go on top of that put the moon in here and you can see it's actually transparent and it plays you can rotate this So 
So you can create some nice animations like this and play with them and they will just work like this. So this was a very quick overview of this new function, new compatibility that was added in Camtasia 2021, support for Lottie files. Head over to lottiefiles.com or any other site that provides these or go and make your own. I may actually cover another video with some software that you can use to generate these. And as you can see, they're much more complex and they can be used just like any other video clip to make your animations more interesting and your presentations or tutorials, whatever you're doing in Camtasia. Thank you for watching. Let me know if you have any questions about this video in the comments. And if you don't have Camtasia 2021 yet, if you haven't upgraded, I think it's worth upgrading and you will find a link in the description. If you click on it, it's an affiliate link and you will be supporting my channel without an extra cost to you. Thank you again for your time. See you next time.